Hey people, what's up everyone? So today I've just made a new tutorial and reviewing video for you about new website builder service which is called Squarespace. What is it? How you can create your personal website with the help of this website builder service. Uh, check this video till the end. All the useful information will be in the description and don't forget to put your likes. So let's get down to our business. So what is Squarespace? Uh, I would say that it is it's a well-known program. I would say one of the best, of course. And of course, this is an all constructor with a long history of development, good budget advertising, with the participation of show business stars and an established audience of followers. Um, functionality is good in places. It surprises with the depths of elaboration of nonsense, but you know, in general, it does not make any kind of revolution. So a solid, high quality product with a unique, recognizable interface and capabilities about average by market standards. And of course, Squarespace offers numerous of useful tools, features for building attractive, functional sites for personal and small business use. So users will need to rebuild their sites if they want to upgrade to the latest version of the service, however. So you have three plans of subscriptions. Um, I'm gonna tell you the beginning part of the video. So the first one is for twelve dollars for per month, of course. But it, and of course we have eighteen dollars per month and twenty six dollars per month. But all billed annually. Yeah. Uh, so um, the next, what I would love to say to you that Squarespace, you know, is a platform that allows you to create sites your personal website without knowledge of, for example, CSS or HTML system, uh, and other markup languages programming, you know. So the platform is universal. It allows you to create effective sites from uh, scratch or based on ready-made templates, which may be in free uh, version or for paid. So everything you can do it right here. So I just decided to make this uh, reviewing video, maybe tutorial video or whatever. I just want to show you how you can create your personal website with the help of Squarespace. Um, let's talk a little bit about templates. So clicking directly right here, uh, we got uh, many templates and you know Squarespace currently has really many templates which are divided into some themes i would say yeah from photography or portfolio yeah we got right here fashion entertainment food local business restaurant services uh, so non-profit communities events weddings musicians and uh, and even food, you know, so uh, actually uh, there are many sections for each one. So basically we can start from the section or we can observe just the examples of this template, I would say, yep. So um, just to see how it looks like and what it is. For example, of course, this is a good option that we can check a preview. Yeah, uh, let's do it. And you know, um, all layouts are responsive. Uh, so we can see that here we have three versions for desktop, for tablet, and for mobile phone. So this is really nice, you know, because I always uh, tell you that, you know, uh, you have always your mobile phone with you mm, 24 hours. Seven. So um, uh, this is very important to have nowadays the adaptive uh, design for tablets or and of course for the mobile phone. Uh, so um, before choosing any template, you can enter the preview that we um, right now are doing. Yep, and just to see how it uh, how it looks like, you know. So what is it? So um, basically, what we got right here. This is a template, but you know, um, that is how it looks like on the desktop version. I adore actually all the templates because they are really nice. They have tasty content and beautiful images. So this is the template for um, the tablet, of course. And we got right here, um, 
for the mobile phone. So everything is, I guess, simple for you. Not difficult, yep. So we have about to start with this design and let's start our work. So basically right here we have the editor, but before talking about the editor and working with the editor, I would say that, you know, this service has pros and they are beautiful responsive designs that are uh, accommodated to mobile screens, uh, deep selling capabilities including digital downloads, free SSL certificate if you want, so good help and analytic tools, this is also the advantage, yep, and you know, Squarespace pages are made up of sections and content block so we can see that right here we have many sections and blocks so this is important to know um, and you know sections are a quick way to lay out a page without designing in from scratch so they stack vertically on a page and are pre-designed containers of content blocks so basically content blocks are the building blocks of sections they are tags, bottoms, images, maps and more and after we're gonna work not work after we will play with it just in a few minutes so in Squarespace web pages consists of responsible responsive sections that can be added in any order, maybe customized, so that is all in your arms, I would say. So here we have a menu, pages, design, commerce, marketing, shadowing, analytics, profile settings and others. Um, so let's check what we've got in the menu section, start from the pages, here we have a plus design, so clicking to this Plus design, we can add blocks, store, portfolio, and some links, maybe blank pages. Um, I would say that pressing this plus at the uh, you know junction of the template blocks, and you can get access to the full list of sections, categories. You can uh, work with uh, the title, list, galleries, pictures, quotes, tags, video content, goals, and others. So you can add everything, links to your, for example, uh, social accounts, some maps, maybe music, price lists. So everything you can do it directly right here. Uh, talking about marketing, uh, here we have email campaigns, CEO, location management, pop-ups, uh, some announcement bars, you know, actually Squarespace has a solid marketing and analytics platform, so these are two separate sections of the control panel. Uh, planning sections squeezed in between them and new feature and the integration of the uh, uh, I would say American service uh, equity which provides service of a virtual business assistant and this is planning building goals you know automating common tasks um, maybe reminders some online payments on the shuttle and so on so but you know the thing is paid and it will cost for you uh, about $15 per month so you have to understand about that but if you have a free version you may try just to um, just to work with this website builder with the platform with the editor so um, let's work uh, directly with uh, the editor clicking we have this bottom uh, edit we actually have this um, this template and uh, remember that working with each template we have the opportunity to create our own website but I would say we don't have too much choices you know as in Wix and um, I would say um, unfortunately or fortunately this is not a drag and drop editor so basically we are here editing each section so clicking directly to each section for example edit the header we uh, we work in this way you know uh, so uh, we can um, upload a logo for example we can simultaneously work with uh, the other versions the adaptive versions for uh, mobile devices yep uh, so some elements for example yep just to add the bottom so it looks really nice we can add social links um, the other one we got to do we can work with uh, we we'll play just with the colors so um, uh, in case right here, so, <laughs> okay, let's wait, just come on, it, you know, it, it, okay, so um, 
let's check. So basically in this way you create your personal website just in method of, uh, you know, uh, selecting some elements, choosing some elements just to see is it good for your website or not. Okay, let it be this one. So that is how you can play with this editor. The next section what we got is the section about... Actually, this is text section. And we have a footer. But for me, it's... For example, I would like to add some widgets. Yep, and we have bottom up at a section and directly we have some categories what we can add for example headlines and i agree with that thing that we should to uh, to choose one of the images and to make for example a main body and let it be let it be this one and right now after the header will be located a picture so we need to wait just a little but you know while we are waiting i would say that the squarespace interface can be stylish and it is stylish and it's attractive but you know as you see right here and i want to show you each detail everything it operates at a medium speed and has an equally medium level of ergonomics so we can observe it right now uh, but you know there are a lot of animations graphic uh, tools uh, but in some places all this does not co combine well and affect the usability so you know, but comparing to the other website builders, I would say that uh, this website builder is also nice to work with, but you just need to try it. Maybe it will be good for you or it won't be good for you. You need to practice, yep. So I'm basically, we have this section with this beautiful picture we can uh, change this picture we can uh, change actually the content right here change the bottom everything just clicking directly to this bottom we can delete it or just change the text for example for example do this whatever Or here, I guess it will be better. Yep, just to add the URL to make the size small, medium, or large, but I guess medium will be better. Just the location, yep, change the location in the center or in the right side. I guess that in the center will be better. Okay, so apply working directly with the text. What we can do, uh, add it to section. So we can change the location. Okay, what I'm doing, I don't like it to be honest. Okay, let it be in the center, but we can make it in medium size, small size, or large size. What about the background? So we can, we actually have image, but we can um, edit image. So um, this is actually the editor. We can play with this editor, and you know, like a picture for uh, editing, like a picture for Instagram, just uh, to make brightness or contrast in other way. 
so like this one or we can can or we can cancel our settings um, and just replace the image and upload um, for example the image from from our laptop or desktop or just download the picture from I would say some free stocks for example Shutterstock, another Pinterest, whatever and after we can use this image right here so guys this is the image that I uploaded right here uh, in this section and I guess that it looks nice but you know in this way uh, you can work with Squarespace but I would say that you know um, the Squarespace is intuitive it may be a straightforward because it has intuitive visual page editor you know um the similar in structure is found in many other systems generally accepted principles are used here and this is the main work area right here so um, you should to fail the editor of course you need a practice but i assure you it's worth uh your time to um to work to see uh, how you can create your personal to feel actually uh, to, in practice how you can create your personal website just in 20 minutes with the help of the square space editor so I guess that this is the end of our reviewing or tutorial video whatever how you um, how you see it. I'm waiting for your comments as usual. Um, I'm waiting for your personal opinion. Uh, I really do hope that my video was useful for you. Maybe you won't be using um, Squarespace or you don't need to create your personal website, but you will know what actually Squarespace is and uh, how you can work with it. Maybe you will uh, use it in the nearest future. So I wish you good luck. I wish you good mood as always. And I guess that we will see each other in another video episode. Wish you good luck. Thank you and bye.